They may be 7,000 kilometers apart and vastly different in size, but Singapore and Ethiopia share deep, common bonds such as being multicultural societies and hubs of their respective regions. Said Prime Minister Lawrence Wong Singapore and Ethiopia also share a determination to strengthen their bilateral relationship and are exploring the possibility of cooperation in new areas such as transport, digitalization and capacity building, he added. PM Wong said this in a toast on June 5 at a dinner he hosted at the Astana for Ethiopian Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed Ali, who arrived here on June 4 for a three-day official visit. Noting that Singapore-based firms are interested in expanding their operations in Ethiopia in sectors such as agriculture, logistics and aircraft maintenance, PM Wong said, Prime Minister Obi and I are committed to take the bilateral relationship to greater heights. On June 5, Mr. Obi had separate meetings with President Taman Shamugaram and PM Wong, said the Ministry of Foreign Affairs MFA. At their meeting, President Taman and Mr. Obi reaffirmed the friendly ties between the two countries and noted that 2024 marks the 55th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations, said MFA. Following Mr. Obi's meeting with PM Wong, the two prime ministers witnessed the signing of a memorandum of understanding to establish a bilateral consultation mechanism between the country's foreign ministries. This will provide a platform for both sides to have regular dialogue on new areas of cooperation and to exchange views on regional and international developments, said MFA. Both leaders also witnessed the signing of a statement of intent between Singapore's Ministry of Transport and Ethiopia's Ministry of Transport and Logistics to further strengthen transport cooperation. Noting that this is the first visit here by an Ethiopian head of government since 1968, PM Wong said Mr. Obi's visit gives extra momentum to bilateral relations. He noted that Singapore and Ethiopia have something else in common, the lion as a national symbol. Our origin stories may be different. But lions symbolize courage and strength, which are national qualities we both strive for and traits our people share and value, said PM Wong. He added, I wish Prime Minister Abi a fruitful visit in Singapore and I look forward to commemorating many more milestones in our relations in the years to come. Mr Abi will make several site visits to understand more about Singapore's status as a regional transport and logistics hub, as well as its urban planning and smart nation development, said MFA. Since 1969, Singapore and Ethiopia have maintained diplomatic relations, with key leaders from Singapore making various official visits. In 2017, then-Deputy Prime Minister Teo Chi Hin visited Ethiopia and held meetings with its key leaders, reaffirming warm relations between both countries, while Dr Maliki Osman visited in 2016 when he was Senior Minister of State for Defence and Foreign Affairs. An avoidance of double taxation agreement was also signed with Ethiopia in 2016 by then Minister for Trade and Industry S. Iswaran, which lowered barriers to cross-border investment, boosting trade and economic flows. In a Facebook post on June 5, President Taman said that Ethiopia has potential as one of the fastest-growing economies in Africa and encouraged Mr. Obi to strengthen cooperation between both countries. He said, We are happy to share our experience in governance and education and strengthen air connectivity, tourism, and business contacts.